Welcome to episode 11 wow, of On The Run. Um, we're back from spring break with everyone. We did skip last week's recording, Josh, so we didn't do one without you. Oh, I forgot about that. I didn't care. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, we did, um, we did some other recordings for... Um, I, can't, I can't get all the way over there. You're so far away from us. Am I far us. away from you? Well, the TV needs to be seen. <laughs> Gotta show off our toys. Um... By the way, you are looking at our very cool Daily Runner Facebook page, which Super you should go cool. like. It's facebook.com slash Regent Runner. Um, so, let's see. Spring break. Had a good break, Josh? Yeah, I did. It was, uh, it was not too busy, but not too relaxing, so it was kind of... Good, good. It was a decent balance. <laughs> Although I didn't have weather like this. I know, it's a beautiful day. It's 70 and sunny. I'm wearing shorts. <laughs> Probably can't see, but... <laughs> Um, good. Me and Chelsea worked all spring break, so we're glad you rested. Apparently not, because you didn't do the podcast. <laughs> we, well, were we were busy doing other things. Oh, 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 sorry. Yeah, important okay. things. Very important business. <laughs> Very important business. Um, okay, so that's kind of exciting. We're, we got, so we've done five video packages that one of the classes here at Region are going to edit and put together for us. So we have some specials coming up including a Luxvera walkthrough, some video examples for our staff members, and a kind of a cool behind-the-scenes episode of News Run. Um, so yeah, we have some exciting stuff. News Run has been doing really well. We get about 100 views in, in a weekend now for each episode when we push it out, so that's good. Okay, so are views coming from the website? Just curious. From our website or from YouTube? Because the YouTube views are kind it comes of not... the same. Oh, okay. So if they click on it, if they watch it on our page, it counts on It'll count. Page. Oh, okay. Um, okay. Yeah, so that's good. Um, we're going to keep pushing video and push back a little harder into vid or, um, print this week. Um, we've been slacking a little, but it's mainly because the website was down and then spring break happened. Mm -hmm. So I think we've got some exciting stories coming up this week with our staff. And yeah, things are looking better here at the Daily Run. Yes, they are. <laughs> After a three-week downtime. <laughs> Um, I'm not going to talk about the newsroom today because that's all changing. So let's talk about articles. Yeah, it'll be the first time in weeks that we've never talked about. We haven't talked about the newsroom. <laughs> Should we talk about selfies first? Sure, yeah. if you want. Yeah. Let's take one actually. Let's all take a selfie. Should we? Mm -hmm. okay. okay. How are we going to do this? I don't know. I'm in the if middle, only I so wasn't so far away. Really yeah, have... you're ruining Jeez, everything Dylan. by being over there. Okay. Okay, we're going to take a selfie on the podcast, which is so exciting. That was great. That was very, very cool. Guys. Going right. down in Daily Runner history. Yep. It'll be up on the Facebook page in a matter of minutes. You saw it first. <laughs> Moments. Here. Moments. Moments only, yeah. Um, okay. Oh, Facebook people will probably see it first. It's just how it works. Click or tap to zoom. This is a cool map by Isn't time. Isn't it? Okay. The new website is very snazzy. Should we zoom in on the US? And on the Apple map. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, Virginia. Look at us oh, yeah. right there. 31 selfies, selfies by 30 users. Seven selfie takers per 100,000 people. That's depressing. We're ranked 323. 31 That's, selfies by 30 users. You know what? I'd rather that than be that like mean? the number one. Well, it's like because it per shows. What? Yeah, the most selfies per like the population. 100,000 okay. people. Yeah. Per 100,000 so people. 30. We're ranked 373. Wow. That's kind of crazy. Manhattan is number two, though, so they, t they take a lot of selfies. That in Manhattan. Sense. What else do they do there? <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Look yeah. Phil uh, Philippines is number one. Makati City. And I'm kind of creeped Pasi. out. How do they know this? How do they get this data? Um, They're spying on us. Yeah, I don't taking know. Taking selfies. We just got well, spied they, on taking that Facebook, selfie. Facebook has that, that um, thing now that can, like, you know, sense people's faces and tag yeah. them. Yeah, that's true. So they but what if you don't post your similar. selfie anywhere? That would be... Oh, then I don't think they could know about it. This is probably just posted selfies. Hmm. If you just left it on your this phone. This totally doesn't count. All those selfies that you take that you're too embarrassed Look to post. Look at the selfies. So this only shows half the story. All those selfies that were like, ew. Yeah, that would be Yeah, so it doesn't count ugly, ugly selfies. <laughs> These what are just the good ones. We were 373 in Virginia Beach. Uh, yeah. Not even close. It's cool that we even showed up on the map. That is kind of Although... Cool. I mean, do we really want to be on the map? I don't know. <laughs> Those guys this, up in like, the like, north aren't thing? taking any selfies. <laughs> 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 Nobody hey, in Canada takes selfies. <laughs> selfies, eh? Hey. Although there's one in Alaska. 
That's this Anchorage, of course. Mm-hmm. So that's interesting. Hmm. Cool. I'm not a selfie hater. I think there are certain types of selfies that are worse than others. For example, the bathroom selfie is pretty bad. Oh, God! It like, like, doesn't matter mirror. what the pose is, you're still in the bathroom. Yeah, no, that's yeah. not good. Oh. I was in Farm Fresh the other day, and I saw a girl taking one in front of the dairy products. I didn't understand it. Well, I feel like this is something my sisters would do. Just, just to be, like, random, like, selfie with the da- dairy products, like, okay. I don't understand the purpose of that. I guess that's... She was really getting into it, too, like... <laughs> like multiple poses. Like, I wanted to be like, can I just take it for you? Like, it was weird. Don't do that. Oh man, I've never been the biggest <laughs> selfie taker. Yeah, but I it's, guess it's a skill. I guess. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Some people like love it. <laughs> we should work on that. We should get better at taking selfies. Think so. Is yeah. there a class I can take for that? A yeah, selfie taking class. I will teach you that class. Is there for a mo- is there a MOOC for that? Are we offering that? A MOOC for selfies. Looks very Be more relevant. <laughs> Take more selfies. Just a little bit. Uh, let's see what else happened. Okay, so that's interesting. Um, yeah. Mm-hmm. It was a cool map. Selfies. Yeah. But wait, which city is the selfiest? It was in the Philippines. Philippines. Uh, Philippines. Makati yeah, and Pasig City, if I'm even wow. pronouncing that correctly. What are those guys doing? 258 all day long? selfie takers per 100,000 people. Wow. I would think this number would correspond to the unemployment rate. <laughs> <laughs> so maybe not. That's a lot of selfie takers that per. Is. That's uh, ridiculous. You have to have a phone to take a selfie, so that's true. You could get an Obama phone. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Let's watch that clip. All right, we'll move on. It's a cool map. Should we look at time since you mentioned it? Yeah, their new I website forgot they is. Uh, their new website. Did they? Yeah, I didn't even know about it. Oh, we were going to talk about cool that. What's cool about it? Oh, it looks cool. It's very doesn't nice. It? Yeah. Is it cleaner or something? And it's like it's got a few columns. I like move that. Around. Columns are good. Snazzly. Is, it, is that a word? Yeah, I'm definitely. making it a word. Yeah. Yeah. Snap like it. Verb, snazzly. It can be a word today. Snazzly. Just today, though. <laughs> it expires in Word of the day. <laughs> All right. Is Get this your well five paths to being the best at Chelsea didn't want to talk about that one. <laughs> oh, Chelsea. Well, I just feel like we're already the best, so why don't we talk about that? True. Yeah. Moving on. Well, <laughs> no, no, wait. Go back. Go back. Oh, okay. All right. Let's see if I can find that. Have great genetics is one of the headlines. Yeah. That's number two. Well, that is unfortunately Super unacceptable. Super important. Yeah. 10,000 hours. Yeah. So hard work pays off. Well, oh, mm-hmm. yeah, we, we all know that, right? Okay. Yeah. Right. Hard work. Uh, ten thousand hours of what? Of you Is know the average. ten thousand hours theory. Oh, to get or, to, or to be like the master yeah. or something. Sure. To be the best, you need to have ten thousand hours of practice, and that's a lot of hours. Yeah. How many? Okay, break that down. Oh, I don't. I don't do math, Dylan. <laughs> oh, wow. That's why we're in this department. We <laughs> 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 can't do that. Three hundred sixty-five days. Twenty-four. Hours. Dylan's the business guy, so he's like numbers, numbers, numbers. He'll take care of it. Yeah. Actually, <laughs> in Google an hour has a calculator. So. Oh, wow. Okay. A year is eight thousand seven hundred sixty hours. So if you spent okay. an entire year doing one yeah. thing, not sleeping, not sleeping, not sleeping. Wow, that's crazy. That's a long time. Jeez. So, realistically, that's what, like five or six years or something Probably. like that? Mm-hmm. Okay. Makes sense. Wow. And then... 10,000 um, hours is an average, though. I think there's a Macklemore yeah. song about that. Macklemore. Have great genetics. About having great genetics. <laughs> oh, wait. There's a Macklemore. There's Hang on. Probably a song about that. <laughs> oh, we didn't Where are we going with this? We always forget. I know. Man. Terrible. There's a <laughs> it's unclear <laughs> where we're going. We're just trying to be the best. You know, read as many articles as Well, possible. I don't think there's anything we can do about this number two. Yeah, um, this science, you could uh, genetically alter yourself, I guess. If you're yeah. like part of the X-Men or something. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I suppose. I mean, that's realistic. That's pretty much what Fringe, the show Fringe oh, is. I loved Fringe. Just people making themselves. That was better. great. I loved it, too. Of course. I'm watching it. That never went it. well, but... I know. <laughs> Taylor had to break a law to do it. It's like, ah, oh, that was such a great idea. Okay, so be part of a great team. This one's uh, very true. I think. Mm-hmm. I think this Definitely. One. Basically, just know people. Know yeah. people. You know. I think we've and seen don't that work a lot with here. people who are terrible. Yeah. yeah. You don't like being around and stuff. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. 
That's what we're working on this year at the day. I need to head out, guys. Yeah. Uh, Chelsea. <laughs> Speaking of heading out, <laughs> uh, be a giver. Definitely. Yeah, that's huge. Yeah. Yeah, so it says researchers who hog the credit on scientific papers are less likely to win a Nobel Prize. Mm -hmm. Don't take all the credit, because it's never just one person. And nobody's going to believe that it was all you anyways, yeah, so you exactly. may as well mm -hmm. just give out other people credit. I remind myself that a lot about the website, because I'm like, ah, oh, I put so much work into this website, and then I think, and it would be a blank slate if you guys didn't, you know, go out and work and write stuff. So it's easy to think, this is mine, but it's really, it's, a, it's always a group project. Mm -hmm. Be a giver. I like how these titles that too. Um, combine them. Only got 5,000 5, hours and pretty good genetics. Combine the two and you get great results. Hmm. So okay. it's like... So as long as you're pretty good at a couple of them. Yeah, so it's <laughs> like you if you reach like the halfway mark here, halfway mark here, and then you just like mash it all together, it's like 100%. Maybe, possibly, theoretically. Yeah. I mean, who knows if any of this actually works? It's all just <laughs> speculative. Yeah, by Eric Parker. <laughs> Let's see what Eric Parker. Let's see what's successful. Oh, just list all his articles. Cool. All right. Oh, is this him? No. Should we talk about that crazy little jet still missing? Oh, yeah. Aliens. Aliens. Chelsea's. Oh, really aliens. I haven't considered that theory. Chelsea's How do you not? Aliens. <laughs> How is that not the first thing you thought of? Or maybe a, a they wormhole? They must be in the Bermuda Triangle. Oh, were they in the Bermuda Triangle? No. No, they were well, somewhere they were saying, in uh, China was it or yesterday? Thailand. They were saying the way the jet like just disappeared off radar and it had to like disintegrate in midair. Right. It would have had, that yeah. That sounds like black hole. Because they didn't find it anymore. Or somebody... And then they found up. oil slips and stuff that turned out not to be from a jetliner. Right. Huh. So they still have not... It's crazy. It's really weird. It's very strange. Because it's, yeah. a, it's a Boeing, too. It's not like some rinky-dink little right. airplane. It's a Boeing jet. We just have fringe events appearing everywhere now. Didn't it's we crazy. find out that there were some people on board with fake passports or something? Though? Yeah, there were two stern passports. They weren't connected to any terrorists or anything, mm -hmm. or as far as they know. Although the Central, today we just saw on Fox, the Central Intelligence Agency still refuses to rule out completely terrorism. Mm -hmm. But it was just stolen passports. I feel like in this day and age, though, when something like that does happen and it's terrorist, they usually claim it pretty quickly. Yeah, you know? I, I would think we'd have heard something about so it. So that's kind of weird. There's been a lot of speculation, but no real clear. I think it's just crazy that they I mean, aliens. <laughs> It's the only logical explanation at this point. Yeah. Or they, We're just going to go with that. Uh, Daily they Runner official, you heard it here first. <laughs> <laughs> they landed on the island and lost. What island? The island. The island? You didn't see Lost? Oh, in Lost. I didn't catch that part. <laughs> yes. Okay. Hey, that's possible, too. Yeah. I don't know. It's crazy. They say maybe it turned back. <clears throat> so that's right where it. they lost them? Yeah. At that 1.30 a.m.? This, this, this dot right here. They lost communication, and this is where they think, you know, maybe they turned back because there was something wrong, so they don't know even where to search. I mean, this is exactly. like this is like lost word for word at this point. It really is. You're right. <laughs> it's, uh, oh yeah, it's crazy. Well, hopefully they just find some kind of answers because it'd be horrible to have yeah, somebody yeah. on there you knew. And well, and then reports coming out today that family members who are missing people on the plane are like calling the cell phones and it's ringing so they were people freaked out for a little while about that but tech people came out and said that that's why just, wouldn't they be that's just the network right. trying mm -hmm. to find the phone so it's it's just been it's hard it's like the hardest when you don't have any answers for yeah. people to understand what's going it's very on very strange so it's interesting keep an eye on it hopefully they find something soon should we check back in on our selfie <laughs> I think we got a like. We got a like on our selfie already? Yeah. Where is oh, it? I got a... Woo! <laughs> <laughs> that was fast. We're so popular. <laughs> <laughs> I got the new Facebook feed today, by the way. Did you? The new hey, Facebook feed? What's new yeah. about it? You want to see it? Yeah. Yeah, show us your Excuse all my crazy friends that are probably posting. Oh, right it looks pretty. Yeah, it's new, see? Why huh. is this better? They decluttered it a lot. Okay. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. I never liked this thing on the side. No, I don't like that thing. Bothers, either, yeah, I like it. Yeah. Yeah. But it used to be a, it like a white background. So now it's got some gray and see the see how the pictures are really nice and big yeah. now. That's so. nice. Hmm. 
Yay, yeah, Facebook. More reasons to waste time. Right. Because we need those. I love wasting time on Facebook. <laughs> Our page has gotten pretty popular this year. We've been doing pretty good on it. Mm. Yeah, I'm going to take credit for that. Yeah. Chelsea's I'm not going to be yet. a giver. <laughs> no, Chelsea's just kidding. <laughs> All right. Should we talk about yeah. para, para, para Olympics? Paralympics. Paralympics. Josh, it's, it's, uh, this is a cool picture. Yeah. I saw one event. It was like uh, it, they were playing hockey. But like the way they had it was like they were sitting on like this like basically just like a long blade and they had these poles and they were kind of like skating around and like the thing is with that it's like it gets super intense because when you know in normal hockey when you check somebody and they hit the glass the glass flexes yeah. Yeah. and stuff when you hit somebody because they're, they're so low to the ground right. they just hit the ice Ooh. and it's it's pretty uh, intense. Didn't somebody get injured recently? Was it hockey or a different um, sport? I'm not sure. Two women I heard got injured, but maybe that was a different sport. I haven't seen much on that yet. It was pretty impressive. I have seen video of them doing this, and it's it's pretty crazy. Was yeah. that snowboard? It takes some. I think. Uh, yeah. This is that looks fun race. right there. I mean, it looks terrifying, but right. It takes some serious talent to do this stuff. Yeah. These are all pictures from the opening. And they have like a, a totally like legit ceremony just for this Paralympic event too. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Um, yeah. That's a big deal. This is the um, Ukrainian oh, yeah. guy. Yeah, a lot of them are um, veterans, you know. Yeah. Who have injuries and stuff. It's a very cool way to see. Look, that's intense. Yeah. That's almost more impressive than like the regular skiers. Almost, yeah. Because I don't know how they. That's that's really impressive. A lot of uh, upper body strength, you know. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Yeah, there are two people who got injured during the training runs from Alaska. Alaska. Mm-hmm. So they are done for right now. I thought it was like during the actual games, but I guess not. Cool. Well, we have anything else? It's kind of short today. We tore um, through our well, we, did, we didn't talk about the CIA. We're going to oh, talk yeah, about yeah. the CIA. Let's With their uh, spying and whatnot. You want to talk about CIA, Josh? Um, well, talk about the CIA. Yeah. Josh is angry. I don't know if I'm angry. I mean, they, they're technically going against the Constitution. If they are doing okay, this, so because the CIA... Okay, because they said... All right, they are supposedly have been spying on the Senate, Senate like okay. members of the Senate, their computers... Um, secretly pulling classified documents from panel's computers during a staff probe of the spy agency's uh, controversial detention and inter interrogation program. So, basically, they've been spying on the Senate, which... That seems strange There's to me. an amendment... Man. I think they said, like, the Fourth Amendment. Back me up on this, guys. It's like... <laughs> back me up. Fourth Amendment, that sounds right. Yeah. Definitely. I question why I don't know. Why when a American intelligence agency needs to spy on the Senate. Because couldn't know. they just request through channels anything they want? Mm, I don't know. I don't know. Man. You could, but then you wouldn't get, like, unofficial things. Senator <laughs> Dianne Feinstein of California questioned whether a CIA search of congressional records might have undermined government oversight. Hmm. It's one of those stories that's kind of still wish-washy. Yeah, a little bit. But even worse, or not worse, but even more confusing is why would the Democratic president instruct his spy agency <coughs> to spy on a Democrat, Democrat-controlled Senate? We got, that, we got some I seriously rogue agents for the life of me. <laughs> Could be. We have them in the NSA. Well, we have at least one more <laughs> agent in the NSA. Who, by the way, did you see that he made a live via teleconference appearance? No. This, I thought in Austin. I did not see that. Yeah, Austin has a yearly uh, tech conference called South by Southwest. Yeah. And what's his name? I just blanked. Snowden. Snowden, Snowden yeah. Came in live via teleconference and babbled for an hour. Hmm. An hour? What did he it talk was quite about? It was long. I... I I didn't read any more about it out of protest because I don't approve of him not being in jail. But hmm. 
Yeah, apparently he used the time to <laughs> campaign for a pardon and weigh in on the tech company. I think I don't think that's going to happen. He should probably just get used to Russia. Yeah. He should be thankful he's in Russia and not in jail, in my opinion. Yeah. I mean, I'm all for it. It's one thing to be a whistleblower, but if you're going to blow the whistle, you and you're not within certain laws, because there are laws that protect whistleblowers. Yeah. If you're not within those laws, I think you should be prepared to do the crime, or do the time if you really think what you're doing is right. Mm -hmm. Which he's clearly not prepared to do. But he said the NSA, what, the quote I read was, the, he said the NSA is setting fire to the future of the internet. Hmm. Which I just shrugged at. He said that during the conference? Yeah, that was his headliner. I thought it was a little ridiculous, but let me see if I can find the article. I just find, I just have such a hard time, like, accepting that he, he shouldn't be allowed to be, like, making public appearances if he's wanted. Oh, well, I mean, but they're going to take advantage of it. Yeah. Because people are interested and, you know, they'll listen. Let's see. It was a while ago. It was this weekend, I think, so it's buried underneath a bunch of Monday morning articles. Yeah, I can't find it. Okay. <coughs> Anyways, it was an interesting. I, I just was surprised that he would be that he would be making public appearances, even via teleconference, based on the fact that he's wanted by, you know, like, at least our government, if not a whole bunch of other ones. He said, would I do it again? Absolutely, yes. See, there's his picture he came in via. And very disgustingly posed behind him is, of course, our Constitution. <laughs> of course. I'd be interested to see how they'll write it in history books because obviously he's going to be in them now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I wonder how they'll paint him. Well, that's the thing. I come from a very biased opinion. You know, I, so some people really think what he did was, you know, good and need to be... I feel like he doesn't have a lot of support. Maybe he does, yeah. but I don't feel like he does. I feel like there's a lot of support for, for the... I'm trying to figure out how to say it. There's a lot of support for the information yeah, Coming people out, are mad about the NSA, but... there's not a lot of support for how he did it, yeah, because exactly. how he did it was crippling. And exactly. it was and it was dangerous to not just the country's national security, which is, you know, a big, big term, yeah. mm -hmm. but to people working in the, in the right. you know, individual agencies. Yeah. Yeah, there are definitely better ways he could have gone about that. And even Absolutely. worse is the core fact is that he used, like, he stole the data. It's, right. He didn't technically have access to all the data he has. So he, he stole... And then ran, and I just, I think he's a coward who hides in Russia, and he deserves Russia. Well, hopefully he likes it there. Right, because he's going to be there a It's a little chilly. <laughs> All right, we'll wrap this thing down. Um, I'm going to run to an exciting Coke thing. K-O-C-H, not C-O-K-E. <laughs> That's fine. Whatever, we know you're just going to go drink Coke. Yeah. That's fine. Um, so this week we have another news run coming up with, um, oops, it's not on it. Angie, I think her last name is General. Um, yes. She's a journalism student here at Regent, so we have an excitement, one of our, a new host for our news run, which we kind of circle our hosts around. Um, and then Monday is a new week. We have exciting stuff. It Some is a new week. You're right. I'm excited about that. <laughs> I need a new week, right? <laughs> I was behind schedule for this week, like Sunday evening. <laughs> So I need yeah. a good week. Yeah. So keep us keep us locked on your um, computers and favorite us again because we're up online and looking. It looks really nice again. And we're updating frequently. So thanks. See ya. Bye.